Our camera's on one man. Will he add to his total of four goals from his last three? It's very much a temple of football, the Santiago Bernabeu, right here on the Spanish capital, Madrid. I'm Derek Ray, and I'm joined for expert analysis by Stuart Robson. And we're ready for the Champions League round of 16 second leg. It's Real Madrid taking on Liverpool. Well, the first leg was a really good game, Derek. It had action at both ends, it was an even contest, and it's set up perfectly for this second leg. Hopefully we're not disappointed. So the initial 11 for the home side. Well, they play with a diamond in midfield, which makes the role of the holding midfield player so important. Is he there to dictate the play with his passing or be a defensive screen? I'd hope he could do both jobs. And the cross comes to nothing in the end. Let's take a look at the Liverpool starting 11. Alisson begins in goal. Nicolo Barella plays alongside Konrad Leimer in central midfield. And they line up with just the one striker looking to do a bit of damage. And a no-nonsense clearance. Well, Jude Bellingham has become one of the finest all-around midfield players in world football. That's no exaggeration. What do you expect to see from him today? Well, Derek, when he's on form, when he's focused, he's a brilliant runner with the ball. He can take on players, he can go past people with ease, and he's got a great shot on him as well. I'm really looking forward to watching him play today. Free kick awarded to Liverpool. Herrera has it. Passing it around, looking for the goal that would put them ahead. Magnificent defending. Attacking possibilities for Real. Moise Keane. And Bellingham. Somehow reaching it. And he's fired over the corner. Well, trying his luck with the header, but too much elevation. Rafinha. Varela. Well, they're going to be very cross with themselves because that was a wasted opportunity. Courtois. On to Herrera. And Liverpool might be able to cash in. Real Madrid have given it away. Well, they need to get tighter. But it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. Well, that break looked so promising, but nothing coming from it. Wasteful again in possession. Pressure exerted, but he keeps the ball. Luis Diaz. Fairly easy for the referee to spot that deflection. So now a throw in. Juhasz. Real in a good position out wide. Teammates in the middle. Well, nothing comes of it. Now breaking at pace. Potential danger. Liverpool have given it away. And we will have just one additional minute. Must be! Well, here's 
the replay. He's done well to get his head up, pick out a teammate, and from there, he never looked like missing. That's a lovely goal. And that is that half-time here in the Spanish capital. Second half excitement to come, we hope, here at the Bernabeu. Well, spot on with that challenge. Diaz must score. It could be up for grabs. Just knocked it out of there. Juhasz. Well, this is the home of live football, EA TV, and we have more live La Liga action for you to look forward to. It's Real Madrid facing Sevilla. And what a game that will be. Two good teams in a great stadium. I'm really looking forward to that one. Just the challenge that was required. Moise Keane. What was the chance they could get caught out on the break here? And players waiting in the center. Well, a disappointing effort, making the keeper's life a bit too easy. <laughs> Luis Diaz. And space on the wing for Liverpool. And you've just witnessed a moment of truly high-class goalkeeping. You're absolutely right. What a save that is. He's reacted so quickly. Well, the keeper made that look relatively easy. In truth, it wasn't. Shuameni. Now with Alexander-Arnold. The defenders know they need to get tighter. Now will the cross work out for them? And a goal! Real excitement here, the equaliser! So underway again here on the back of that leveller. And it's with Curtis. Juhasz. Here's Robertson. Well, he went strongly into the challenge, and the result is a throw-in. Juhasz. Vinicius Jr. Vinicius! Oh, a goal! The ball's in the net! A hugely important moment in the story of this tie! So back underway at 2-1. Tight contest here. Conrad Leimer. And a fine tackle. Real chance. And now he must score. And a goal. And I'll tell you what, that gives them a bit of a cushion now. Well, let's take another look. Yeah, he won't get an easier finish than that. The defending was all over the place, though. Well, there's a man who knows his team have been really good today. Just what Ancelotti would have wanted. So there it is. 3-1 the current scoreline here. <laughs> Luis Diaz. Diaz. And a chance to whip it in here. It should be. And denied by the keeper. Impressive. Real Madrid have been awarded the free kick. Just ten minutes remaining here. And the challenge halts them in their tracks. Oh, this looks useful. And the goalkeeper has outdone himself with that save. And time for the change now. 
and played short and the cross into the middle and he's dispatched it well they've left it really late here they need another goal in order to send this game into extra time Vallejo Juhasz here's Robertson Vinicius who can he pick out took a really smart piece of defending to stop them into the advanced position and whipped into the box brilliantly blocked the referee's whistle full time it is and Real Madrid are the side who move on well, Derek, that was a tough game. They had to work really hard to edge it. Credit to them, though, they didn't have it all their own way, but they showed a lot of character and resilience, which will hold them in good stead going forward into the next round.
A glittering occasion. It is the final, but only one side can emerge victorious. Who's it going to be? Stay with us, we'll have all the action for you live from Madrid here on EA TV. Well, no doubt about it, the nerves have been jangling in the last few days, but very soon the wait will be over. I'm Derek Ray, joined by Stuart Robson in the commentary box, and we're just seconds away from kickoff in what promises to be a thrilling finale. It's Real Madrid, and they take on Las Palmas. Well, it's been a long journey for both these teams, Derek. It's not been easy, but these players are 90 minutes away from making history for themselves. Oh, surely! And off the post! All academic, however, it's offside. So we can check on the starting lineup. Well, a diamond in midfield can be a good system in a 4 4 2, but only if you know how to play it well. Yes, they should dominate the central areas, but they could be vulnerable out wide. Pequeno. This is Enzo Loyotis. Schiller. Sandro has it. What attacking possibilities. Can they forge ahead? The opening goal in the final. And how important could that be as a direction pointer? Curtis. And Eden Militao. Tackling like that, the onus is on the referee to take action, potentially. Well, deemed to have been a cautionable offence. Well, no question about it. He deserved his booking there. Chouameni. Now, who can he play it to? Oh, how about that for the last line of defence? And able to close down the shot. Far from a good pass. Dehinho. It's with Sandro. No oh, good vision. Vital intervention. the space really well you've got to say Could cross it in here Munir and there it breaks down but credit to the defence you have oh this is looking promising Oh, what an opportunity, but really good defending, you've got to say. 
Hayden Hackney. And he's certainly not alone. But really sticking to the task defensively. Jude Bellingham. And offside, unfortunately. to Real Madrid and Bellingham Moise Keane textbook defending inside the box doing their bit to keep them out danger here as he runs at them well I take my hat off to him because that was superb defending Robertson Real Madrid trailing here at this corner could be helpful to them. Oh, God, it is! The equaliser in this final. What next in the drama? And so it is. The first half has come to an end here in the Spanish capital. And as the second half commences, both sides can reflect on a first half in which they were so very evenly matched. Credit to him for the challenge, and the throw-in conceded. Robertson. Well, this could be a chance for Real Madrid to jump ahead from a corner. The oh, really good header, really fine goalkeeping. Being pressed here. Oh, lovely work to get past his man. Danger still on. And Real's creative tendencies coming to the fore. Well, it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending. Well, it's just about a case of wall-to-wall -wall football live with us here on EA TV. And Stuart and I will be with you for this game coming up. That should be a tasty encounter. Plenty of quality in those two sides. Certainly one to enjoy. They need to get tighter. Example of how to press. Benito. They might be on for them. Moving the ball nicely, but can they forge ahead? Ezequiel Palacios. This is the home of live football. I'm excited to have more action from La Liga coming up for you. It's Las Palmas. Must take the lead here. Oh, he's been denied. And they remain locked together. Well, that's a good save, but really he should have scored from there. That's a big chance. Increasing the pressure. Another corner it is. And over comes the corner. In a good position to clear it away. in the defence physically strong and secure on the ball cross 
promising opportunity. Good technique displayed. Might jump in front. And a goal to put them in front. Real drama here. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Bellingham. Juhasz. Real Madrid attacking, and they have to give it a go with time not on their side, but quick thinking defensively. Well, not far away from the final whistle, and Real Madrid have got to pull out all the stops. Well, it's been a fairly even match, but at key moments, they've just been second best. They could have defended better for the goals, and they've missed opportunities at the other end. It'll be a disappointing result if it stays this way. Substitution for Real Madrid. Sandro. Duarte. Johnston. Well, no problems defensively. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? Well, that break looks uh, promising, but nothing coming from it. And just one minute of time added on for stoppages. Late in the game here, and they know what they've got to do. And it's all over. It is a story of silverware secured. They've done it. They certainly have, and they deserve to do it as well. They were the better team today. They were absolutely excellent. And now it's all about enjoying these very special celebratory moments. Well, just look at the joy on these players' faces. Absolutely incredible. And now they prepare to walk together in anticipation of the trophy presentation. Well, it's now just beginning to sink in. They are the winners of this great cup second now they'll be able to hold it aloft congratulating each other and rightly so the sweet taste of success and they don't want to let go of that trophy do they absolutely not they've worked so hard to win this trophy they've been brilliant throughout the tournament and a top class performance from them and their fans Four marks to the...